Hello everyone, welcome back. Today our video is on serum electrolyte blood tests. Now, you might be wondering, what are electrolytes, and why are they so important? Well, stick around, because we're about to break it down for you. Electrolytes are like the body's own supercharged team of nutrients. These minerals are positively or negatively charged ions that conduct electricity when dissolved in blood and cellular fluids. There are several key types of electrolytes that we need to keep a close eye on for maintaining optimal health. They are sodium ions, potassium ions, chloride ions, magnesium, phosphate and bicarbonate ions. During serum electrolytes test, blood is tested for the body's main electrolytes such as sodium, potassium, chloride and bicarbonate levels. Sodium is essential for fluid balance, nerve transmission, and muscle function. It's commonly found in table salt and processed foods. Potassium is crucial for maintaining heart health, muscle contractions, and even plays a role in nerve signals. You can find it in bananas, potatoes, and leafy greens. Chloride often pairs up with sodium, helping to maintain fluid balance, regulate pH levels, and support digestion. It's commonly found in table salt bicarbonate, which helps maintain the body's acid and base balance. It also plays an important role in moving carbon dioxide through the bloodstream. An electrolyte panel is often part of a routine blood screening or a comprehensive metabolic panel. The test may also be used to find out if your body has a fluid imbalance or an imbalance in acid and base levels. You may need this test if you have symptoms such as vomiting, confusion, weakness and irregular heartbeat, indicating that your body's electrolytes may be out of balance. During the test, a small sample of your blood will be drawn and sent to a lab for analysis. These are the normal values for serum electrolytes blood test. Abnormal electrolyte levels can be caused by several different conditions, including dehydration, kidney disease, heart disease, diabetes, acidosis and alkalosis. But fear not! Maintaining a balanced diet, staying hydrated, and staying active can all contribute to keeping your electrolytes in check. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more health tips. Thanks for watching, and take care of yourselves.